For months, businesses across the country have been asking, where's the money? Brick and mortar stores fighting to survive due to the pandemic, among the latest to file for bankruptcy. The century old Charlotte based retailer Belk. So what's in store for the store that used to set the pace for retailing here in the Queen City? WCNC Charlotte's Lexi Wilson has the story. At its peak, Belk was the place to shop. Belk helped give this community economic momentum. Pictures from the Charlotte Mecklenburg Library show Belk's early years, from the 1800s, the first store in Monroe, North Carolina, to the 1900s, the flagship store on Trade Street in Uptown Charlotte. Business was good. Charlotte was the, the cotton trading center. Folks came here because the railroad connections were so good. The minute they came off the cotton platform with a little money in their pocket, they saw Belk. But change is inevitable. Belk filing for bankruptcy today. No part of the retail industry has suffered more than department stores. The pandemic accelerating its decline. Belk filing for bankruptcy. When you hear bankruptcy, you think maybe you know, they're closing their doors. Nope. It's the first step to Belk's reorganization plan, cutting its debt by about $450 million, allowing the retail icon to move forward as it navigates through the pandemic. The bankruptcy is a lifeline. The future for Belk is still uncertain. But the key to surviving appears to come from the strength and love of the Belk name. Family are very much committed to civic leadership. Many believe they helped Charlotte grow while also promoting charity and giving back to the community. We reached out to the Belk family for comment. They declined. Reporting for WCNC Charlotte, I'm Lexi Wilson.